point is it's big, it's massive, it's growing, it's lucrative, it's high profit and low risk. And the penalties largely around the world, if you're caught in trading wildlife, are, are minuscule compared to the penalties for, say, trading in drugs. Crawford Allen is director of Traffic, the wildlife trade arm of World Wildlife Fund. You think that the illegal wildlife trade is actually could be more appealing than dealing drugs? If you are involved in a criminal activity and your business is to make money illegally, wildlife trade is a great business for you to get into. Globally, estimates place the illegal wildlife trade at around 10 to 20 billion dollars per year. The underground black market is flourishing. Creatures like tigers can be worth more dead than alive. The composite parts of the tiger can all fetch up to probably potentially $75,000 to $100,000. Yet to buy a live tiger, in some cases, you probably could could pay two and a half to five thousand dollars because they're so difficult to keep and, and maintain.